Want some decent monster parts to fuse to your weapons, but don't want to or can't take on these guys? Well, you're in luck. You can win some pretty decent prizes at the Lucky Treasure Shop in Luralin. And yes, that pun was intended. Cloin the shop owner allows you to pick a lucky chest every few in-game days or replay if you bribe him with a roasted porgy. <laughs> I've had some pretty decent rewards from blue to white Lionel Saberhorn. Depending on which item you want and its placement, you're looking for this color rupee. It's been consistent for three times for me. Blue is the middle one and best prize, red is the right and second prize, and green is the third. Just think of them as sideways traffic lights. Note that this isn't consistent with the value of the rupees, as you know, green being one, blue being five, and red being 20. Not only that, but if you restore the restaurant, you can get free food and better still, learn new recipes. Speaking of free, the inn gives you an alternative place to sleep and restore your hearts. If you run out of roasted porgy, you can usually find a set of three by the pier, which isn't too far away from the lucky treasure shop. Convenient. To get these shops, you'll have to first clear the Luralum port of the Pirates with Monster Forces quest and then help Bolston with some free labor to fix up the buildings. To help him, you'll need 20 Hillian rice and 15 logs. Not palm tree logs, but regular logs. The Hillian rice you can just cut the grass nearby or spend some rupees to buy some. The logs you'll need to get through the entry of the Luralin village. Once you provide the supplies, you get to choose the order in which the buildings get done. Hope you enjoyed this video. Here's one on the strategy I took to take back Luralin village.